Hi, welcome back to I've Had Worse, and today it's the first proper ale of the new year. Uh, a friend of mine on Facebook recommended that I try Fuller's London Pride. So here we are, Graham, this one's for you. So this is a 4.7, comes in a 500ml bottle. I can't ever remember having it. I've had some Fuller's beers before, but not London Pride. So I'm really quite interested interested I'm really quite interesting lots of people testify that I'm not that interesting I'm really quite interested in what this tastes like oh, not bad for me not bad for me okay so quite a nice design on the bottle around the base it says from the uh, Griffin Brewery um, and on the back it says Fuller's Brewery. So I don't know what that is about and I've not done any research online. If you know, please drop it in the comments below. Perhaps they're one um, in the same. It could be one in the same. It could be an old London brewery. Um, it does, there's a little bit of spiel on the back, you know, the essence of our capital city and the people who call it home. <laughs> yeah, I always get... You know, you get that on a lot of wine bottles as well. There's a, oh, that's what I call wine bollocks. Okay, so we have a crystal clear sort of amber beer. Little light carbonation. There was a head which is dissipating. A little bit of sort of toffee on the nose. Okay. Any tasting notes on the back there? No, it just says crafted and timeless around the neck. Okay, let's go for it. Lovely mouthfeel, nice bitterness all across the tongue. Not a biting bitter, a little bit biscuity. It's not overly carbonated, uh, uh, which is quite nice. I do like sometimes a sort of still or flatter beer. Um, biting carbonations are, are, are sort of good, um, crisp, refreshing, like lagers or ciders. But sometimes you would just want something quiet to cough that's uh, to cough. Quiet to quaff. I just, it's the first one, I swear to God, it's the first one in the evening. Yeah, sort of subtle maltiness, biscuity. Well, things developed on the, uh, on the nose there. Okay, well, what do I think of this? This is just an easy drinking, sessionable ale. Um, doesn't shout, a um, bit understated, you know, it's not in your face. Just a lovely bitterness. You could sink a couple of these, absolutely no problem whatsoever. Um, yeah, there you go. London Pride. Yeah, I think they've got something to be proud of here. Cheers.